Now for the posterior mediastinum, the area behind the fibrous pericardium. The important structures here are the descending thoracic aorta, which is the continuation of the aortic arch, the esophagus, which after leaving the superior mediastinum enters the posterior mediastinum. And in addition to these important tubes, there are the right and left ganglionated thoracic sympathetic chains and some important nerves coming off from each of these sympathetic chains which run within the posterior mediastinum. There are lymph nodes in the posterior mediastinum, in fact quite a profusion of lymph nodes. And also running up the posterior mediastinum from below upwards is the thoracic duct, a large and very important lymphatic channel. Also, there are veins in the posterior mediastinum. These are the vena azygus on the right side, and the corresponding veins on the left side are the hemiazygous and the accessory hemiazygous veins. So these are the important structures in the posterior mediastinum. Your anatomy matters.